Well, Los Angeles golfers are having a hard time booking tee times because brokers are snatching them up and selling them. Darren Haynes explains how one fed up golfer created a movement to stop this scam and the new rules LA municipal golf courses are making to help free the tee. I know why it's impossible to get a tee time in Los Angeles. Someone is buying all the tee times with bots and reselling them on the black market. Dave Fink is mad. Fink is a Los Angeles native and golfing teaching pro. He and many others have complained for years it's nearly impossible to get a tee time at a LA municipal course. And you sit there and 30 days in a row at 6 a.m., the only times that are returned on the dot are 2 p.m. times. That's just not possible unless something is happening. So Dave and some of his friends went the extra length to find out what was really happening. At 6 a.m., and they did not leave until 1 p.m., and they asked every single person teeing off, hey, how did you get this tea time? How did you get this tea time? What did they say? Well, everybody said nothing until one person. That's when Dave was able to finally see why he couldn't score a tea time. I actually got a broker's number, and I ended up texting him, and he responded with a barcode to oh, enter to enter the group on Cacao. What they see is this, Harding, 8 a.m., 7.20, 8.40, 9.50, 10 a.m., 10.20, 10.50, Those are all before 2 o'clock. These are all in the morning. I'm not done. So he started a movement known as Free the Tea. What I need you to do is tag LA City. Tell them this is not okay. And use the hashtag Free the Tea. And his evidence got to the right people. Is this like kind of what you guys are referring to? Hope I can see it. That's similar yeah. to the post that I, yeah. see, I yeah. saw. It was clear to me that it looks like there are tea times available if you pay this service charge to a, to this this concierge service, this broker. That that's that's red flags across the board. So an LA City Golf Advisory Committee meeting was scheduled, and Dave Fink. If you love making golf more accessible and affordable, and if you want to free the tea, you will be there with me and a bunch of other golfers were there too. I've never seen a meeting that had so many golfers uh, yeah, yeah. show up on to speak on public comment. It, it was clear that, you know, we, we needed to take this very seriously. That led to officials with the city of Los Angeles approving a new measure to crack down on brokers who resell tea times. In the board report, the pilot program will enforce a non-refundable $10 deposit for each golfer, and you'll lose your deposit if you cancel. The new policy starts April 16th. How much do you think the problem will be solved with the solution that we have right now? In looking at how reservations are booked, canceled and rebooked, this looks like a really good first step. Let's actually grow the game in a responsible way, which means giving people access to the game who otherwise cannot afford it. Because if right now, if you can't afford a country club, you're out of yeah. luck. I appreciate Darren doing a little investigative journalism here because it is hard to get those tea times. No question. Yeah, keep them affordable for everybody. Absolutely. Right. Yeah. All right, thanks, Jamie.